case briefs and so much more ls data's got what you're looking for in 1989 the court of appeals of maryland heard the case of walton v jaskiewicz a dispute centered around whether a restrictive covenant could be selectively amended to exempt one property in a subdivision samuel and helen walton property owners in the brock hall subdivision wished to subdivide their lot to do so they needed to amend the Declaration of Covenants, which they attempted by gathering signatures from a majority of other property owners. However, some property owners disagreed with the amendment and filed a lawsuit, arguing that it was invalid as it did not apply uniformly to all properties in the subdivision. The court considered whether a majority of property owners could amend a Declaration of Covenants in such a way that only one lot would be exempted from a restriction against further subdivision. The lower court had initially declared the amendment valid but this decision was later reversed by the Court of Special Appeals, which held that any amendment must apply uniformly to all lots. Ultimately, the Court of Appeals ruled that the Declaration of Covenants governing the Brock Hall subdivision did not allow for selective changes that would exempt a single lot from a particular restriction. The Court explained that allowing such amendments could lead to serious consequences for minority lot owners and disrupt the orderly plan of the subdivision. The judgment affirmed the invalidity of the amendment in question, siding with the property owners who opposed the Waltons' attempt to change the rules for their property without applying the same changes uniformly to all properties in the subdivision. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.